Hello friends, I'm Colonel Failure and you're back with Transport Fever Peninsula. Uh, we open today's gambit uh, by standing here at the side of the line uh, that is heading from Asgard to Arkham and uh, the train's coming past as we speak. Uh, we'll follow it along because uh, that's, this is where we're going to start off. It would have been a pretty odd choice if this was not where we were going to start off, uh, so following it along is the right thing to do. Uh, yes, we built this line last time around and it's part of a, a kind of a Y junction uh, to hook up several different towns. I mean, I say several, I mean two. Uh, two different towns to one, uh, to one destination, uh, which should hopefully lead to a bright and prosperous future. And as you can see, we've got a, we've got a good stack of passengers waiting to be picked up and, uh, and that's all jolly positive. I think we've got about 20 on board. We've got exactly 20 on board. Um, but, uh, but that's purely down to the routing of passengers to the station at the other end. Uh, it works somewhat okay uh, at the moment. Uh, it does make a little bit of profit. We're, uh, we're just ahead of the curve right now, but obviously that'll go up once we, uh, once we hit our destination. And then I'll show you something else that I've done in Asgard, because, you know, I've, I've not rested on my laurel since last time around, and, and I completely wrecked the, uh, the initial upload. Uh, but uh, here we go, and this could have happened maybe a little more crisply than, than it has done in reality. There you go, touchdown, 103 in profit. Okay, that's pretty good. It should take a full load back the other way, and then I'll show you this new tram line that I've constructed. 40. 40 is okay. Uh, I have constructed a new tram line, friends. Uh, so previously, the uh, the onward journey from Asgard out to Toonsville, Townsville, Townsville. You've got Toontown and Townsville, two separate places. Um, uh, the connection was from the uh, the centre of town uh, by Aubessant. I see. I've noticed there isn't an L in it for the first time ever. Um, and uh, and I went, nah, that's no good. I want them to go to the station. So I built a, a tram line that runs all the way from the station here in Asgard, uh, all the way up to the main kind of interchange here in Townsville. And, uh, and that seems to be working reasonably well. Let's pick one at random. You, how are you doing? 4,000 in profit, reasonably well. Uh, I think that uh, I think greater profits await us in the future. But, uh, but that's all good. Anyway, today's objective, and I've got 340 odd grand to make it happen, is to, uh, is to start to, to modernize other areas. And I can't help but see already that Moss Eisley is looking inviting. Okay, I called out Moss Eisley, but actually it's not the only uh, member of a party that's doing really rather well at the moment. Um, uh, recently, we modernised the Ankh-Morpork through to Shurma, Moss Eisley and Caprica City route. And it has to be said, it's working really well. Uh, let's, uh, let's have a quick look and see how it's doing on the profit meter. Uh, Ankh, Sherm, Mice, Cap, as you do. Uh, where are we? Uh, if we if we search by balance, actually, it should turn up near the top. There we go. It is showing up near the top. Uh, we've got eight vehicles on there. It is running 100% full. But disappointingly, it's only generated 60-some-odd profit at the moment. So as much as it is working really rather nicely, it's not making all that much cash. Uh, one would hope for a slightly larger influx of readies. Uh, from a route with this level of demand. Now, the smart thing to do at this stage, uh, let's have a quick look. How far have you got there? Uh, Ank, Sherman, so forth. 40 odd passengers waiting. This one, 30 going one way, 40 going the other. And then Sherman, you've got uh, 30 and 20. Well, I'm rounding down just for the sake of, of uh, speed. And then at this end, 30. Well, it would it would appear to be a no-brainer to fling a couple of another couple of trams on that, because uh, it is it is doing very nicely indeed. Uh, the only thing, any issue, I can only spend the money once. We've got six hundred and change in the bank. Well, six hundred and quite a lot of change, but obviously we just rolled past the month. And for this year in total, we're up three hundred grand. Now you're talking. We're starting to get to the point now where where I can. Uh, I can do more development without having to uh, to hang around for ages. Do I? Yeah, I'm going to put another. How many? 
I'm go. I'm going to go relatively, uh, relatively minor with this, and and that ain't it. Uh, where's the uh, Where's my tram depot? Here we go. Uh, we'll stick another three on there. Uh, we'll go with the Halle because that's working reasonably well for me at the moment. There you go. Get to work. Right. That's only going to nudge it forwards by a little. If we look at an individual tram here, uh, just at random, you made five and a half last year. You've made close to ten this year. So you're only looking at another 15,000 in profit per year if we take the, the kind of the low end of the, uh, of the option there. So it all counts, but it's, uh, you know, this is not going to, to save our collective bacon. Um, now, what I would quite like to do, however, is start to get this end of things working. So I think maybe another tram route that operates Mega City 1, Raccoon City, Alpha Complex could be the way to go. What makes me think that? Well, because I'm looking at it now, uh, we do want to try and get all towns uh, developing at a similar pace. So, uh, so yeah, all right, let's go for it. All right, all right, all right. We're going for it, everybody. Um, right, upgrade you, electric tram track. Uh, yes, that word. Uh, electric tram track. Right, where's out? There's out. Now, Mega City One, I think, uh, I think is going to be not a mega city at the, at the current stage of uh, of events because it's all building on this cliffside here, and uh, and it's obvious the AI is having st some struggles in trying to uh, trying to get it to 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 extend the, um, the the amount of buildable streets that it's got going on. Whether or not that uh, that manifests in being difficult later on, don't know, but it's certainly struggling right now. Uh, however, we're not too concerned about that in the short term. No, look, I don't. I don't need to upgrade all of it. Just enough to uh, see. I mean, you, you've got you've got the twin the twin vipers of. I don't want to work. <laughs> look, that's eighty three grand's worth of yeah. Turn it into city street. To think that the city is going to extend that far, I think, is is possibly laughable. What I need to do is place down a very, 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 very small piece of street here uh, in order to... No, no, not that. In order to... Yes, this. Just give me something cheap. Keep it on the flat. There you go. Right? And then that should break up the, uh, the, the, onwards, the onwards sprint that we've got going on here. Right. Upgrade that. C... It's almost like I occasionally know what I'm doing, or that I at least fluke it, making it look like I know what I'm doing. Uh, right. No, don't upgrade that bit. I want that bit left alone. <sighs> right. Okay. Now, now we're now we're motoring. Now we're making progress. Um, now these tram lines eventually they will all be exchanged for uh, for rail instead. But I think where we've got in in town or in a city. Uh, rail routes that are that are pending because we're using trams at the moment. Instead, I think I'll I'll just make the tram system a little bit more robust. Uh, possibly incorporate some uh, some some bold commuter services. How much did you just upgrade there? That's okay. That's will allow it. Oh, that's that's mighty generous of you. Uh, but yeah, here we go. It's not even a not even the twentieth century yet, and we're already giving people some uh, some very fine looking. Uh, fine looking roads, you did all of that. Obviously, your due care attention is now leaving the building. Uh, but, uh, you know, it's, uh, it's one of those things, I suppose. Uh, now, the hope is that by making this a faster service, how am I out of cash? Well, you've, you've been spending it all on roads that you already had. Oh, yeah. Yeah, that's, that's the thing that happens, isn't it? Yes. Uh, right, okay. Well, I've got, you've got enough to finish the job, so finish the flipping job. Uh, and then, uh, and then we'll be in business to an extent, and uh, and we'll. You've just got to come up with the fifty grand a tram. It's going to cost to replace this lot. Uh, yes, uh, yes, indeed. All right. Okay. And then and that, and then we'll make an actual an actual cornering kind of round the block for it to deal with. There you go. Lovely. Now you just need a depot. What was wrong with the depot that's there already? Well, that's a bus depot, and you're probably going to want that in order to uh, to trade in what you've already got. This area here looks relatively flat. See if you can't stink one. Stink one? Stick. Oh, that's what I thought you said. Yeah, it is. 
Uh, see if we can't get one stuck on there, and then uh, and then we should be golden. Am I completely broke now? That's a big yes. Uh, right. Well, let's let's take a moment and have a look and see how we got on. So last year I spent one hundred and fifty thousand, well one hundred seventy five thousand on new stuff, um, and uh, and still came out in the green at two hundred and forty four. So that's that's four hundred k plus in the green if I hadn't spent any of it. Obviously, I spent quite a bit of it, and that, that I didn't spend, I have lashed out this time around. I've spent half a million on uh, on upgrading this road. This had better be worth it. Uh, and also, this is this is also a dom selection. <laughs> I know, self-critique is, is my jam. Uh, it's a dom selection because none of these towns really have connections to anywhere other than each other. And when I say they don't really, they don't at all. These three only talk to one another. And therefore, I'm not going to generate any additional uh, amazing growth somewhere from, uh, from this forthcoming uh, tram route adventure. What it does suggest, however, is that if I were later on and feeling flush and rather foolish, uh, if I were to put a train station around here somewhere in Mega City 1, and we route round or through or over or beside the mountain to get to Caprica. We can link those two lines together. This might seem like a very minor thing to do, but uh, what you end up with as a result is uh, is, is far greater demand because people uh, hop from town to town, effectively, um, to, uh, to, to make that work. Right, now then, you, 30 grand, sir? No, I want, I want to pay less than that. Well, it, it cost 16 grand, it's worth 15. And, oh, I have, <laughs> and the money departed me at just the wrong time. Uh, we're just gonna, gonna just stay here for as long as it takes until I've got 15, seven in the bank, which will happen any moment, because we certainly wouldn't want to be staring at this for too long in a piece of video entertainment. No, sir, no, we definitely wouldn't. Three grand, there we go, there you are. Some. It was close, but uh, but we made it. Uh, right, okay, let's uh, let's create the line here. As mentioned, it is fifty grand a tram, so uh, you know I don't I don't think we're going to be overburdened with uh, with tramitude in the uh, in the foreseeable, but uh, but we'll see how we go. Uh, right, okay, Alpha Complex or Alco uh, through to uh, this next one, Raccoon. I can't even remember how I abbreviated that. R A C That seems plausible, doesn't it? And an MCO. Um, all right. And don't uh, don't make the classic mistake. Hit Raccoon City on the way back as well. Right. Okay. So you are into City. Mm-hmm. Into City. Yeah. Uh, Alco pops. Uh, R A C and M C O. All right. Exciting. Now then. Let's do we ah, as a thought do we leave the buses on hold on a second thought no oh, that was, that was a, a minor diversion of a conversation there uh, the reason you don't leave the buses on is because trams don't overtake and therefore it's just going to cost you money so there's 50,000 a tram and I'm going to want a few of them so I'm not going to deploy any or am I yeah okay we'll deploy them because it will start spacing them out uh, in city Alco Rack MCO. Okay, hold on. Does that mean that Alco MCO is already doing that route? I bet it does. It does. Okay. Well, no, that's okay because what we'll do is we'll just close that route down eventually. How about now? No, if you close it down now, as much as it will help this tram not get held up behind this tiny little steam car, uh, you you. you you're not going to run a profitable service. Uh, go. There you go. In fact, I could have just left everything on the existing passenger line there and used these as replacement vehicles while they bed in. Well, I could have, but I didn't. No, you really didn't. Oh, we've got enough for two more. One, two. Good. Set line. Alco and so forth. What? Wait, what? Set line. Alco and so forth. You flipping can find a path to the stop electric. Don't you? do No, 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 no. None of that. Come on, come on. Give me enough money before the end of the month. Otherwise, we'll have to wait another month. There we go. There's one. Any more? Go on. You can get one more in here for me. Go on. One more. 
August the 31st, and no. All right, okay, I think we might have to just go with that for now. Right, Alco, Rack, MCO, that's what, four, five, four, five. It's either five or it's four. Uh, whichever one it is, that's how much I've got. So, uh, so let's go find the old route. Uh, Alco, sort by name, that'll make it easier. Uh, right, Inner City, Alco, MCO, here you are, nine vehicles on there. This doesn't even have a running time in a moment, and it was five. Uh, and then you want to close it down. So you're on the wrong page for that. Oh, okay. Uh, buses, yes. Line, line. Alco. Intercity, yes. Does it think it's a tram route? It possibly does. Let's kill off some of these dead routes. Uh, several of you said, ah, oh, kill off the dead routes, man. Kill them off, otherwise you get passengers waiting. Only for about a month. The passengers pretty soon wise up to the fact that there are no trams coming, ever, or buses, ever coming, and uh, and they, they, they get to uh, get to grips with that. Right, you lot, go get sold. While we're about it, close that down. While we're about it, set the replacement on this, and Halle, thank you, good, right, smashing. Now, the good news is those trams will soon be able to get up to their, uh, their appropriate running speed. But we still don't have a frequency report on those, which is a bit of a concern. I'm going to guess, however, that it's not quick. So uh, I've got the cash. We'll, we'll fling another one up there as well. And then this is, you know, this is then business as usual. We're, we're then in the same situation we're always in, which is where uh, we'll spend a bit of time and a bit of money building something. And then we have to wait until that something pays itself back so that we can then go build the next thing. Uh, I had look, I did look at the San Diego Electric Trolley. It's not as fast. That's why we're not using that. It's it's newer, but it's not as quick. There you go. One more. Go on. Go on. There you go. Right. Alco, MCO, Rack, and so on. Right. Good. Did that last one get out as well? I don't know. I didn't see it. Yeah, you... I don't know why you're having a disagreement with things there, chum. Uh, I mean, even if we'd forgotten to electrify the actual tram bunker here, uh, you could have just got some hefty lads to give you a push out onto the track and then everything would have been whizzy. But uh, that's okay. Don't worry about it. Right, now, we've got, we've got a fair bit of traffic here at Raccoon City um, waiting for passengers who are, who are clearly disinterested. Oh, hello. What's this? Uh... Atlantis to Mega City 1 doesn't have a connection. I know, that's the bridge. This is reporting problems. Tram 26 is reporting a problem. Turn it around. There you go. And then, then it will sort its life out. You are reporting a problem. Could not connect to all the stations. Uh, did I miss a bit of track? I've missed a bit of track. I have missed a bit of track. And I don't have the money to do anything about it. Alright, call up the you probably spotted it already. All right. Right, so... Where does it say the problem is? Uh, that is between MCO and Raccoon City, apparently. Oh, you know what it might be? I possibly need to put a, a stop on the other side of the track. Or... Hold on. What are we... What the... What the... What the what? Well, there's none there. That's that's a problem to start with. To put that in. Okay, is that it now? Yes. All right, and then the second thing you need... To, oh, you've probably got it already, but let's just double-check that this stop in the middle actually has shelters on both sides, which it doesn't, which means that the, train has to, the tram has to do some kind of wacky manoeuvre. Um, uh, I don't know. If I'd, if I'd have... If I'd have been a little bit quicker on the draw there, we would have got in before all my money disappeared. Which is terribly disappointing. Uh, so yes, I need a tram stop there. Otherwise, everything that comes in here has to do some kind of exotic manoeuvring. Right, let's, uh, let's whiz past this. There you go. Accelerate the turbos and the, and the action in the business. Uh, and then that'll help us. There you go. That's it. And right there. Thank you. Now, I am still, in case you were wondering, in case it needed mentioning, uh, I am still running with the, uh, hold on, what's this? What? Did I not do this bit either? What am I, where are we? No, that's the end of the line. You're okay. 
you know, okay, don't uh, don't panic unless you have to panic. Um, yeah, I am running with the four times time mod uh, currently disabled because uh, there's no, there's just no point to it. Um, uh, later on, there will be all the point to it once we start getting into a little bit more admiring what we've done rather than trying to done the thing in the first place because because uh, that's that's where we're at at the moment. What's uh, why have we got a procession here and where are you going holding everyone up? I'm gonna the depot! Aren't you though? Yeah. I mean, between this daisy chain we've got going on here, I tell you what, this makes for quite a nice picture. There you go, bit of a, bit of a shot. If I can get the cables to stop clipping. Nope, 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 there you go. That's a bit of a shot. There you go. Yeah, with them daisy chained together, you'd think they'd just push him up the hill. And then off the side of a cliff. And just gonna go, no man, you're all tech. We're not interested anymore. Get off my roads. The roads are, belong to the trolley. The, for it is the future. Is it a nice view going up there as well? In fact, there's nice views everywhere. Uh, as, uh, as awkward as this map is to work with, it, uh, it does look quite appealing. Uh, right, okay, now then, why are you turning around here in Raccoon City? Why are you turning around here in Raccoon City? Because when you put a stop on the other side of the road, you should have done it at Raccoon City and not where you actually did it, you gigantic turkey brain. Um, okay. Turkeys don't have gigantic brains. I know, you do, uh, but it's only as capable as a flipping turkey's. Right, how did we end up doing last year? 300 in the hole after spending... Uh, what's that? 800. So we made half a million. Well, give or take. I mean, you know, that's a bit of a bit of a generous rounding figure you're using there. Hush, man. I'm, I'm, I'm taking it. I'll I'll take whatever whatever we can get there. So that one's going to take a little while before it gets anywhere. As you can see, all of a sudden we have no passengers waiting for it at all. Um, which might be an issue. Uh, let's uh, let's have a look. We've got a running time now, at least, and that's six minutes. Uh, but it is uh, it is losing me money at present, which is not what we'd hoped for. Uh, the Anxure Mice Capra is uh, is currently pushing ninety five k. All right, that's uh, that's a bit more like it. Um, but as you can see, that it, the, you know the number of passengers we've got waiting here and there is actually starting to uh, actually starting to look pretty good. And uh, you know what else I should have done? You know what I should have done? Is I should have just extended from Caprica to Beauclair and Erie. Uh, and made all, of, made all of them part of the same happy family that runs from Ankh Morpork to Caprica. In fact, this, is, this really does suggest itself as a mainline passenger route. And don't go, I'm, I'm not using the, the sense of the mainline in the same way as I did in the last series. Uh, yeah, running out from Ant all the way through, yeah, to Erie, and then down to Townsville, and on to Asgard. There you go, I mean, there's loads of options you've got there. Um, uh, the, uh, the density of the number of towns that we've got, lending itself very nicely to, uh, to a great deal of, of different connection options. I am looking at Arkham. Look at this lot. Right, so there's loads of passengers waiting at Hogsmeade, because they all want to go places. Uh, but at the moment, they are being forced to travel on a bus. The poor people. Uh, at Arkham, meanwhile, you've got plenty of people in the centre of town. You've got, a, uh, you've got loads waiting to get on a train. This is all pretty good. Uh, let's finish off by, uh, by having a look at the, uh, the town sizes. Here are your towns. And here are the sizes. Uh, New Vegas is the, is the, uh, is the big dog in terms of being underperforming uh followed by mega city one which we are now connecting up and that should bring it back into uh back into some kind of growth and more pork is uh, is growing but slowly raccoon city is also in the bottom bunch yeah you've you've built in the least profitable place imaginable good going you uh meanwhile moss Eisley, caprica atlantis Shermer, arkham we've visited all of these places and that's possibly uh partly why they're working and the other possibility is they were going to work without my interference anyway. Uh, then when we look at lines, uh, so let's, yeah, let's look at the bad news first. No, the bad news first. Zion Rapture is only sporting eight passengers. We've got to make that work. 
that's that's our next objective. Uh, Alco Rack MCO currently is not performing well, uh, but then it is still bedding in. I think within a year that one will perk up quite nicely. If it doesn't perk up quite nicely, it'll be because I've done something really, really wrong. Commuter Iron Forge is awful. Um, Commuter Zion is okay. Actually, commuter routes are okay because we make the money back on the on the connections. At the top end, uh, the three Gen 1s are in there, but we are aware of, uh, of trains that require replacement. The only reason I've not replaced them so far is because they're making some money anyway. All of which leads me to search for something to watch to round out our show for today. And I'm going to watch something interesting. Uh, well, okay, it, interesting if you like trams. Uh, or, or pleasant scenery. And look at this lot, all bunched up. Look, that's, this is not the way to run a modern network. Right, you, put the brakes on. Let that one get away a bit. Right, I've been Colonel Failure. Thank you very much for watching. Um, we're going we're to have a few more. Uh, very limited uh, growth potential action adventure items uh, while we uh, while we try and get the cash situation flowing because the the dream is that uh, you've got enough cash coming in so that you can go spend on something exorbitant um, and then not have to hang around all day to to wait for the cash to rebuild we're close but as yet no cigar um, anyway in the next episode we're going to go and try and fix that train line that is currently losing us all the money. And the only way we can do that is by running some more passengers into the stations at either end in order to get them on board. Where are you? Where did you come from? All right, well, you... Bye, then. All right, that was mysterious. Uh, anyway, subscribe if you've not done so already. Uh, the, the series will become more perky as we go on. And, uh, and once it's finished being perky, it will probably be quite entertaining. Uh, I'll catch up with you very soon. Go on, then. Yeah. Yeah, go on. Go on, and I'll, I'll let you go as well. And then uh, I'll tell you what, we'll ride on this one. Cheerio! One step forward, one step back. Business as usual. Actually, no steps back. Uh, everything is kind of moving forwards nicely at the moment. Uh, the, the amount of profit, air quotes, there for you, because I care. Uh, that we're making is actually pretty reasonable. And uh, and if I can continue to drive that number up, then we can start to take on more ambitious projects on the subject, of which I think the next episode may have a fairly ambitious project in there because the Zion Rapture line has... It's got really good possibility in terms of making money. Uh, I've just got, to, just got to make that work. So I think if I turn my attention to that next time round, yes, it'll be expensive, but I think the upside could be significant. <laughs>